Hello, it's Dennis Bunnick here from Bunnick Tours. I'm enjoying a lovely balmy summer's night in Zagreb, Croatia. Uh, Europe is open and COVID restrictions are being eased week by week. Uh, certainly, it's ready uh, to be, Europe is ready to be welcoming Australian visitors. Now, a lot of you will be wondering whether to travel this year in 22 or wait until 2023. Well, I can give you a very good reason why you should travel this year. And that is that as the world opens up, some of the world's largest travel source markets are still closed. Combined with the fact that over the last couple of years, Europeans haven't been able to travel long haul, so a lot of them are uh, venturing further afield this year, means that Europe will be a little bit less busy this year than, uh, than normal, and certainly a lot let less busy, a lot less busy, than uh, it will be in 2023 when the whole world will be open and everybody will be traveling. Now we do still have availability on a number of our uh, small group departures from July through to October. Um, but uh, hurry, because these seats will feel fast. And if I can give you a hot tip, Europe 2022 certainly uh, is the way to go. And uh, being on location here, I can tell you, it feels very, very good to be back in Europe. And obviously one of the best things about being back in Europe is enjoying that evening al fresco lifestyle, sitting at one of these outdoor cafes, restaurants, and uh, just watching the world go by. It really is the ultimate holiday experience. Yeah.